Hey guys, welcome back to Matlock's Toy Room Reviews, and today doing something just kind of a little weird, just something I wanted to show you guys, uh, I was at Toys R Us last week, and uh, never seen these, I'm sure you guys have seen them, people go to Toys R Us a lot more than I do probably, but uh, these are the best lock toys, they're like the uh, ghetto brand Legos, and I just figured I'd buy them, check them out, because they were dirt cheap, I got two sets, got this uh, police set, and it does say they work with other brands, but I haven't tried them. I probably should have done that before this review, but uh, <clears throat> got the police set, the small one, which is 240 pieces, and I got this big set, which is like the uh, firehouse set, it's got like the firehouse, fire truck, motorcycle, boat, and just like a little trailer thing. <clears throat> And uh, I figured I'd just do this video just to, uh, if anybody had, you know, ever wondered, I'm sure a few people have wondered what these are like, if they're any good or not. But, uh, you know, I had a good time building these things, and they were dirt cheap, uh, like I said. Uh, for the firehouse set, you got the boat, the fire truck with the extendable ladder, the trailer, uh, motorcycle, and then the firehouse with like a little table and set up stuff for here. Uh, that was only like 16 bucks, which is like damn cheap. And then I got the uh, police station, a helicopter, a cop car, and then a motorcycle too. <clears throat> and that, that little set was only uh, $8. So uh, if these were Lego sets, they would have definitely been you know way more expensive than that. But uh, you know, I wanted to check out the quality of them because <clears throat> I have... I uh, had some Lego type stuff before that didn't really work very well. And uh, these, you can definitely tell that these aren't Legos. I mean, this is by no means to replace Legos. Because uh, Legos are definitely awesome. <clears throat> and quality wise, you can tell a difference. But uh, they do click together really well. Uh, the plastic's pretty nice. It's made of a pretty nice plastic. Uh, the pegs are all real nice. <clears throat> but there are some quality issues, like some sometimes you find a lot of like plastic hanging over the sides. Like I took an X-Acto knife and cut off some of the stuff. I mean, it wasn't on every piece, but there was a few pieces that had it. And uh, I was really happy about all of the all of them really clicked together well. Um, some of them were kind of hard. Like you had to really like force them on there, and they left my thumb like red and throbbing. But uh. You know, they were pretty good. Like, I was worried about them being too loose and falling off. But, uh, they're pretty cool. Just give you a look at some of the stuff. It's kind of cool. Fire truck. It's got, like, this hatch that opens up. There's a little peg in there so you can hang something in it. Come with some different accessories. <clears throat> um, pretty cool looking firehouse. It's got, like, the dish that spins around. It's got doors that open. The windows and stuff. And a flag. It came with a bunch of decals that I haven't put on. I only put on a few of them. But uh, there's like a little table, a little, uh, I don't know what that is. Some little station with a steering wheel though. But here's the police motorcycle and the uh, like fire motorcycle. I don't know, they're kind of cool though. <clears throat> and then for the police set, you got a helicopter. Just top to spin. Looks pretty good. And the police car, which is kind of cool, it does open up and as that piece falls off. <clears throat> Very cool. And the police station, which is pretty cool, has a little dish on top as well. <clears throat> and like I said, you know, these aren't perfect or anything, but something I just kind of gave a sh gave it a shot, you know, and I had a good time building them. It was fun. <clears throat> now. That's for the bricks. These do come with uh, like Lego figures, like the minifigs. But uh, I advise if you do pick up these sets to just throw these things in the trash. These are junk. The bricks themselves are pretty nice and the sets, they're not bad. But uh, these minifigs are garbage. 
if you can see just the way they look is pretty crappy but uh like I'm sure I can't you can see like the legs are really janky and like they just feel really crappy I don't like them personally <clears throat> so uh, those are gonna go in the trash as far as I'm concerned but uh here's some of like the decals and stuff that you can put on I put a couple of them on but not all of them <clears throat> And then they each had their own little uh, instruction sheet. I think this was to build the uh, police station. You got a couple pages and stuff. So it's kind of cool. All of them have instructions. So, you know, overall it's a pretty fun set to do. And dirt cheap. So if you're looking to pick up something for a kid, maybe. I'm probably going to give these to my son. You know, these were pretty fun to build. <clears throat> Good time. And dirt cheap. So definitely a cool gift. You're giving something to a kid. Um, very cool. So these were the best lock building bricks. Um, thanks for checking it out.